What's up, everybody? Tony Skinjili here with 7 Star Phoenix Unlock Gameplay. Now, I was able to record this footage myself. Uh, unfortunately, I recorded it on a toaster I found in a dumpster underwater, so it might look a little grainy. I apologize in advance for that. The thing I'd like to mention before going into this is I failed my first attempt. Uh, due to the fact that I assumed it was a beat-em-up mission and not a strategy version of an unlock mission. I fixed that the second. Uh, now my team was significantly overpowered for this event. I don't believe that is a requirement for anyone. I believe the lowest reported was somewhere in the 150 to 160 range. So don't feel like you need to have a 200k team to defeat this. Just know a little bit about how to win the fight. So you'll notice uh, the fight starts with a full team of yours with a Phoenix and a Scarlet Witch versus one lowly Phoenix. Do not worry, her friends will be here shortly. What I would recommend to do upon starting this fight is to dirtle. Take a turn off, spend the abilities that you don't necessarily need immediately. Uh, you're going to see very quickly how this fight changes. This is an 11 person fight. Phoenix immediately summons a relatively terrifying uh, pairing of people, so you just want to make sure you don't kill Phoenix uh, for as long as you can, uh, and that's actually a little bit easier than it looks, considering all five of the characters you bring uh, don't actually do damage, so you're just going to spend a little time dirtling, running around, summoning guys, and making sure you're hitting anyone who is not Phoenix at this point in the game. You can do some damage to her. I, the optimal strategy I found was do everything in your power to make her kill herself. Uh, try not to kill her before she would uh, use her special ability again, which takes about five passes. At around this time, you can probably expect a decent drop. Uh, just worry about getting rid of the characters as they come up and making sure that Phoenix does not return as quickly as you can. The good news is, your Phoenix will trigger faster than the others and you should be able to obliterate them. Once Phoenix is down, the rest of this fight should be So even though the fight lasts a little bit longer after the Phoenix goes down, it, it, none of your characters were ever at risk. You were going to win as long as you just worked down the damage dealers and found your way to victory. And that brings this video to a close. Thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Tony Scangeli. Have a good night, have a great day, and I'll catch you later.